Okay. I hope that this mic holds properly. <sighs> I feel so hungry. God. What are we going to be talking about today? What's up everybody? It's a new week and I'm here to fill you in with all of the little greetings that happen over the week. And of course, we're here to give you the highlight. That's entirely what this show is about. Run you down a couple of things that happen in our entertainment industry. Raise up, sit down, put on your seat belts because we're about to drive really fast. You know how it is? If you're following us and you haven't clicked in that red button before, click it right now. Don't go anywhere. Any my neck the carry head. Any my head carry sense check. Yes, yes, yes. Like I said, we're going to be driving really fast because this highlights of the week over the week a lot of things happen and we are here to dissect all of that for you so the first on the list is Hyman General Salatiel of course the last time we spoke about Salatiel on this show in depth was, was in 2019 of course we already remember when the boss of Alpha Beta Records and the crew now of Anita made a featuring with the big big Queen B Beyonce of course and it was much talked about there were all of the speculations and stuff that happened as far as that was concerned immediately after the featuring on this particular song what's up with beyonce and pharaoh williams just subsequent days later on after his couple of travels and media tours going to south africa and all of these random things he did announce one of his albums that was coming up and which was africa represented such a project africa represented was anticipated by so many people and this project was later on put on hold yes yes the famous project was only recently put out in 2021 yes exactly a year later after announcement a lot of things changed about it there was greater preparation the marketing strategy the outlets of reaching to people the press conferences and all of these things that he did to release this album and of course the songs in it i have personally listened and we're going to do an amazing special edition exclusively about this album but the information however is that this album is available on several several online and streaming platforms spotify apple music not on youtube yet but you can get it on all of all the streaming platforms and of course for your ears only he did shoot one of the videos of the songs from the album with the haitian artist Grochelle, which is already at two million in just two weeks amazing vibe and amazing amazing reviews coming out of this album the several future tenny of nigeria and several other international artists such as stone boy salty soul we had mr leo we had pascal several featurings on this album and of course the album just like the name has it it's a representation of what africa truly stands for you don't need to be african to actually understand the rhymes the music in the album speaks for itself what are you waiting for but to purchase it on to the next thing i think that cameroonians are beginning to put us on the map several several people that we talk very little about during this week one of the stars of course who has featured in a couple of amazing amazing movies with the name viola davis who has featured in movies like how to get away with mother and of course suicide squad and several other amazing movies came on instagram to reveal this amazing attire that was designed by a cameroonian designer and the cameroonian designer in question is claude Kamini, yes, Claude Kamini made this design just like she has done for several other artists such as Janet Jackson and several other people in the American entertainment industry. It's amazing how Cameroonians, designers, artists are beginning to put us in the world's fair. These are projects that we cannot give a blind eye to and of course we can only but give accolades amazing stuff that claude camini is doing it's amazing how many blocks of course in cameroon haven't really really addressed this issue as much as it's supposed to be no doubt no wonder why some nigerians are beginning to own her and say she's nigerian of course she is not nigerian claude camini is of bamilike braid and of course that's only from one place in the world that we know that's cameroon for us amazing stuff 
amazing stuff our designers are doing. Congratulations to you, Kamini, and keep soaring, man. Keep putting our name on the map. Talking about all the amazing moves that are happening in our entertainment industry, Large Belly recently announced a new signing with Prince Dado. I know how the internet is beginning to speculate that Large Belly is finally signed to a record label, and I was like, what? Of course not. That's not what the signatory is about. I think that the entertainment industry is segregated into several platforms. You can sign deals that are not necessarily record label inclined and stuff like that. Their signing with Prince Dado is literally only gives Prince Dado the opportunity for Blanche booking. If you want to book Blanche for any event, for any concert, for any show, you can only pass through Prince Dado. And Blanche was recently of course on a press conference for same reason so blanche is not signed to any record label she's still running her own record label which is hit zone and she has been doing her music as an independent artist for a pretty long time right now she's only signed of course for booking deals if you want to book blanche you know how to go about it talking about cameroonians who are beginning to amplify cameroon this really small country making it look so big one of the people is tight Yes, we already know the French artist, yes, but Cameroonian born, Cameroonian blood. If you cut him, he's definitely going to bleed Cameroonian blood. He recently put out a song titled Le Temps, and he's been crazy, crazy, crazy out there. In our next edition, we're going to do an exclusive pointing out five facts that you don't know about Taik's latest new song, Le Temps, Inspired, and it has impacted so many lives, just a few days of release, and the streams are crazy and amazing on several streaming platforms. Is this not how you put a country on the map? Of course it is. It is. Yes, I know in this edition of the show, we have spoken of nothing else but the good, right? Yes, we are always assessing the bad, the good, and the ugly. But what an amazing show with all of the positive vibe that is going on. Yo, but before I leave this set, something happened over this week that we cannot avoid talking about. One of our comedians called Cabriel Najib recently backed himself a deal with the Ami Sanitary Part Company. Yeah, 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 you heard me well. He recently backed himself a deal with the Ami Sanitary Part Company. Yes, of course, the comedian in question is a guy. Yes, he's a man. And the internet didn't take it lightly. I think that the internet went really crazy and people are like wait what there were no female entertainers in this country to get such an endorsement deal how on earth do you endorse a man sanitary pad does it mean that such a man can actually really use it or show girls how to what's the point as confusing as it is i don't really mind man it's Cameroon for us. <laughs> All we can do is marvel, ponder, and wonder what on earth is going on and how are men getting endorsed by Any sanitary pad companies? Head. Oh, Any Lord. A Cameroonian artist check, in the diaspora check, called King K recently check, got check, so check, disgruntled on the internet and I was like, you know, I just released my new song, but unfortunately, it's not going to take as much rounds or it's not going to go as viral as it's supposed to go because this is great art. And the single reason why it's not going to go as viral is because I live in America and I was like, oh, damn. They say that I'm this, they say that I'm that, I don't care what they say. I don't care what they say. If the money not there, then we give a day, cause that polo the pay. What can we buy? We know my estate, you want so that it should go back. Mama met the tunnel. Yeah, and you all know what that means. I think that there's some crazy negligence when it comes to diaspora artists as far as Cameroon is concerned. Cameroonians don't give so much attention to diaspora artists. We're going to treat this particular topic in full in an exclusive show coming up. But like I told you, this was supposed to be the highlight. If you love our show and you love what we're giving you every week, do not forget to click in that red button below. And of course, ring the bell so you can always get the information. Huh. You know how it is. We're always here to give you what's hot and what's not. Ever smiling black boy. Karawa. Life is la la la, hakuna matata. I wanna papa, me and my mama, mama. Bong zungo, bong zungo, bong zungo. Bong zungo, bong zungo, bong zungo. Man a man, akrapan. Anyhow, I be peasant. My top of day in high demand. So popular, like na contraband. Uh huh, let my badge on. Hey! Uh -huh. To go ching on buto. Uh -huh. Push him now. You won't control me, yes, or the sequoia. Scale lock, pay for my head. Oh, man. 
Chop my choppers with the pop up, 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 the tongue up. Life is la la la, hakuna matata. I wanna pop pop me and my mama mama. Bong zungo, bong zungo, bong zungo. In your diary.